What's up, Squires? My name is Joel, and I'm the Backlog Knight. Welcome back to Uncanny Valley. Um, this is day something something in the Uncanny Valley gameplay series, uh, because the game has stopped keeping count of how many days there are, possibly because I broke the game, or because I'm supposed to be dead. Possibly both. Probably both. Um, this is also the first episode that I'm recording um, since after my knee surgery. Uh, apparently it went well, uh, it was successful. I say apparently because I'm still recovering. It's very brutal. Um, I'm on a lot of um, pain meds right now. And uh, moving in any sort of way uh, for the lower body really hurts. So uh, this is kind of a temporary setup I've set up for myself so that I can keep recording episodes for you. So that I can keep bringing you content because I really want that. And I feel that if I can at least well, if it isn't Tom, oh, we'll see that later then. How's work? How'd you find me? Please, I just tried to get away. I don't... Shut up! We've been looking for you since you skipped town Tommy. Since you skipped town Tommy. You made quite a hassle for us. Listen, this place is packed with valuable tech. Why don't I let you in, and we just forget about this? Oh, we're gonna have a look around, don't worry. And after that, we can resolve our little situation. Oh, he just... He just punched my lights out? Why? What happened? They followed me back home. Oh, those were the shadows? Wait, what the fuck? Skeletal rig reconstruction. I pressed space one time. Okay, the episode just starts and everything's already fucking going mental. This is not gonna be good. Okay, so something got them, I guess. That's a lot of blood. That is a lot of blood. Are those guts? Oh, oh. Oh! Oh my god! Holy shit! Okay... What the fuck? Eve, what? Did you do this? How? Playing house. What just happened? I am so confused. I am so confused right now. Okay. What is this? What did I just pick up? Heavy box. Okay, I have a heavy box. I also have two key cards, which are the two key cards I need to get back. Uh, down there. Now I'm a security guard again. Good morning, darling. Did you sleep okay? And that's a screen for outside. Eve? Where the hell am I? What are you talking about? You're home. These nightmares of yours must be getting worse. How did you know about my nightmares? What's going on? You're always so funny when you wake up. I see you're already dressed. I was only able to find a uniform for now. I am getting the rest of your clothes later. And keep out of the storage, dear. I just organized everything. Something terrible is in storage, isn't it? 
Oh my god. Of course it's a big fucking door to the storage. It's locked tight. These are heavy doors. No way of breaking them from here. Okay, but don't I have a... Oh, it's a safe key. Wait. Storage key. Oh, it's a storage key? Oh, God, I need to stop pressing enter. Oh, I mean, uh, escape. So observation is on the other side. It, it looks like an office. I think I... Where the fuck am I? I'm gonna pay for this. Why am I here? There's a body there. There's a body there. And, and I can't check it out. Oh. Oh. That was... I just pressed the... Apparently, just pushed the shelf outside of the dimension. I dropped the heavy objects. I don't need it anymore. Are you sure? Are you sure, Tom? Because you could just shove it at someone's head if you need to. There's something blocking the vent. It can only be opened from the other side. How convenient. Oh my god. I don't remember this place. Oh, wait, wait, what's this? It's a tape recorder. There's an empty tape inside. Cool. Why can I still hear her cooking from here? Is it cooking? Oh, emails. Fuck, I jumped. Okay. So, let's see. Um, uh, okay, so don't worry, we wanted to see how well the new PPAS recognized the stress in the human voice and if they can recognize a familiar voice in a crowd. So we had the Vox guys send us some recordings. Worked like a charm, they always prioritize the voice they recognize as well as human safety, even if it means harming themselves or their surroundings. The AI guys did a really good job. The bent steel door is because we installed zip with new system to test strength. The other PPAS don't have it yet. Cool. Uh, what does the other one say? Come on. Just, 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 what does it say? I can't read the other messages? Oh, there you go. I think we got it down. The good thing about it you can remove it and use it as a tool on your own the bad thing you can't use it in the same way as they do because the recoil is too much to handle for our bodies but it's still powerful enough to be used as a car jack or something similar i don't know what they're talking about we're probably going to find out when we go into received messages um i'm having some problems designing the mechanism we discussed yesterday as of now it looks like a one-off. There's no way to retract it back, so it could be used again. The testing is about a month away, so we need to figure this out. Come by ASAP. And the one before that was, could you... Hold on. Those are all sent by this person, which is Dennis. Uh, could you bring your team down today at 5 p.m.? We're discussing a new solution instead of the coolant. The board things, it's... The board things, it's... Uns I cannot read this fucking font. I'm sorry if I read slowly. I usually don't read... Like I'm six, but um, yeah, this is why we take a lot of care into the font we use for things we do in game design usually. Uh, unsafe to implement it out of all the things they draw the line here. Also, if you have a company that's advanced enough to do AI and that sort of manufacture and have things that evolve with emotions and human safety and all those details, why do you use a font that looks like you're drawing everything from an Atari fucking system or I don't know like a commodore um so adrian sent i uh, decided to come to work early today and i see one of the testing areas is a bit trashed again and no one around to tell me what happened even the security metal door is bent open okay that explains the metal door i really don't think the project will last if you guys had another incident um then layla says i'm coming next week we're having some problems because our shipment still hasn't arrived plus testing on zip i think it's either two ip or zip isn't uh, going as well as planned and the rest of the PPAS aren't 
as far developed because David seems to be focusing only on zip for some reason. Wait, is zip a word that's being used to not say the word? Because then that's Eve. That's probably going to be Eve. And then David would probably be the person that's on the tape recorder for the tapes that we found in the early episodes, right? What do you guys think? I think that's it. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, wait, no. Is there just the one computer? Okay, just the one computer. That's fair. That's fine. There's something... Okay, we know this already. Yes, okay. What about this door? Oh! I'm in observatory. Cool. Sure. I'm gonna pay for this. Some heavy doors. No way of breaking them from here. What? Okay, well, can I use something, maybe? What is this? That's the tape recorder. Okay, nothing we have that can help us here. Sure. Let's get out of here. That's a wall? That's not a wall. Okay, let's open this door, then. Okay, that just dropped from zero to metal really fucking fast. Observation in progress? Oh my god, I'm super fucking nervous. Oh my god, what's happening? Oh, it's saving. That is just... Not great. Oh, okay. Something's banging on the door behind me, so I probably left a monster there. That's a human, or a monster, or a thing that probably wants me dead. Let's walk away from it, quietly. Oh my god. Get him. Oh! Oh shit, I am limping though. Okay, so he caught me after saying you. And now I can't run. But I'm guessing I, I can go that way now because there's only probably gonna be one of them there. I can also can't crouch. I don't know what's going on. I'm just fucking terrified right now. What the fuck? How does this work? What's going on? Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. I don't... Okay, I passed into another room. Good for me. Oh, that's where Eve was. Oh, okay. And now I'm trying to return? Is that my bone showing? I think that's my bone showing. Oh my god, I... The label on it says Android AI reconfiguration. Sure? On his own. Wait, hold on. What is it? Okay. I just got worried about what happened. Everyone's company email in the AI department got shut down temporarily because they think someone tampered with the AI. Peter's already working on a solution. I am freaked out. Sorry. Wow. Um, on his own. I'll let you know how it goes. Um, David was pissed. Zip got commissioned for disassembly along with the other PPA builds. And he's trying to convince the board to at least let him keep working on the rest of the PPAs since Zip was a more developed build than the rest. Why do you... Oh, hmm. Uh, we made an override for, the, uh, for David at a moment since they, don't, they won't let us adjust the current AI. It strips down the AI to just basic functions, turning the target into a helper more or less. I sent you one just to make sure you turn the PPAS sleep function on the first, on, sorry, on first and then just point it at one. It automatically scans the override and applies it. Best of luck and see you when they let us back in. I feel like such a moron reading these right now. Oh my god, I think that is my... Also, what the fuck attacked me? It looked like a big fucking skeleton. Oh my god. Everything is so oppressive. Okay, AI training. Sure, and there's a door. Oh, that, that's it. That's where Eve was. 
Yeah. And there's there's gonna be all this gore, right? Of all these dead people. Oh my god. I can't run! Oh wait. That means that in my inventory. Yeah, my leg is fucked. That's why I never found a single fucking bandage the entire game. Jesus. So, I was right. Eve took a liking to us. She hasn't killed us yet, but that thing also almost tried to murder us, though. I can't do anything to these things, though. How? What? I, mm, I don't understand what I'm supposed to do. This game is absolutely confusing. Super confusing. Right, I just woke up here. I don't actually know where I am. Or how to get there, or out of there for that matter. Neat. That's perfect. That's just great. Okay, let me just... Come on, is that what I'm supposed to do? It isn't, huh? Jesus Christ. Damn it. Okay, time to press E in front of everything I fall into. Okay. Okay, let's see. Sorry, I'm getting a lot of messages right now for some reason. Uh, only when I'm recording. Only when I'm trying to record. God damn. Okay. What was I even saying at the beginning of this episode? Yeah, so I'm trying to have episodes so that I can uh, have these uh, like things keep going, even though I can't really... Um, wait. Wait. What did I just pick up? An axe! I just found an axe, kids. Okay. Cool. We have an axe. I'm guessing that's useful for opening doors, too. Possibly to fight that big robot thing? Mm -hmm. Maybe. I don't know what works and what doesn't work in that game. But I'll be, I'll be very honest with you. Um... Oh, great, we're here again. Arr. Oh my god, I'm super scared. Like, if I die, or we find some kind of weird answer for something, I might just stop, because this game is so confusing. So basically, let's not go in that door that I closed and... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What the fuck? Okay, so... <laughs> oh, let me explain what just happened. So the first time that something happened where I guess I, I hit him in the face, maybe, I guess, or I don't know. I Either I hit him in the face, and most likely, actually, he, he shoved me to the ground and my things never worked because I just tried clicking on the axe thing. <sighs> I'm so nervous. Okay, I just tried clicking with the axe on the skeleton and it did nothing two times and he just smacked me to the ground. And he just shuts off every single time he attacks me, so maybe that's what happened. Um, but... Uh, the first time where everything froze, I'm guessing, for you, because I don't think OBS records if I click out of the windows, because I panicked when he ran after me the first time, and I, click out, I clicked outside the window. So, I couldn't see anything, and I tried to go back in. So, I'm sorry for that. That was my panic that caused that. Um, however, now they shot me down, like, three times, and then Eve is there saying, Thank you, my dearies. I hope you didn't hurt him too much. We love each other, you know. I will make sure nobody can hurt him ever again. Tom, my poor Tom, why can't you do said to be trusted? You always get into trouble. One day you will manage to kill yourself. And what will I do then, huh? I'm afraid I'll have to keep you from hurting yourself. Don't worry, we can live here forever without any disturbance. I'll take care of you, I promise. Now, 
This might hurt a little, but remember, I'm doing this for your own good. Now, hold steady, it will be over soon. No, 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 no way. Did she cut off my arm and then cauterize it? And then cut off my leg and cauterize it? Oh my fucking god. I love you. And the achievement is happily ever after. Okay. Okay, that was super fucking disturbing. Um Okay, so let's let's look at the facts here. Um I got the job, I broke all the doors, I got the key card. I also remember the pa it shouldn't change. So I also remember the password for the key, so maybe I can just go straight up there on the first days, get the key. And then get the second key card from room four oh something. Fourth door on fourth floor, I think it was, that I can get it, if I remember correctly. And then uh go straight into lower levels? Maybe? Or would that bring the hooligans to get me again and I'd be stuck in the same situation? Cause I think I broke the game. I don't know how I did, but things happen so suddenly and without any sort of context that I don't know what I'm supposed to do at all. I'm super confused. Um, not sure. If you guys can leave me your comments below, I'll try to act on that. If not, I'll just do my best, I guess. That's... This game, It's it's got... You, you can tell. It's got a clearly superb fucking atmosphere. It's amazing, but holy fuck is it confusing. And the game design is made in a way where it doesn't keep you from doing specific things that might break the game, and it's not very clear. I'm not sure I'm super, super fond of it, except the atmosphere is super gripping, and I kind of want to know what happens, except, of course, now I already figured out that Eve's a fucking crazy robot killer thing that loves us for some reason, just like she loved the other person that she destroyed, apparently, and everyone left the facility for. Um, I don't know who the hooligans are, except that I think they are basically the people that were chasing me home in my nightmares um the black shadows so that answers that question uh what else yeah so i can probably get the keys go in the lower levels and find out what's going on there why the fuck this is happening no guarantee though i'll see what i can do but that's going to be for another episode what i wanted to say for um at the beginning that i couldn't finish which i guess i'll finish now which is perfect at the end session um is that well uh, yeah, I, I've, uh, you know, the first two days after surgery were terrible, I could barely get out of bed. I still barely can't get out of bed, but I can walk around a little bit now, and I'm more lucid, although I take all this medication to take all the pain away. So I'll try to keep doing more videos for you. I hope that you can keep enjoying that. Um, this game still fucking terrifies me, so that's a good thing. I kind of don't want to do it, partly because I'm scared, so that's a good reason for me to go back. Um... So I'll see what I can do with that, and see if we can find uh, a third ending, I guess, at least. Uh, I'll try to keep you guys posted, uh, I'll try to keep doing videos. Let me know if there's anything you would like to ask, or anything you'd like to say. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up, that encourages me a lot, and of course, subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more of this. Um, and I want you guys to see Super Zen. This has been Joel the Backlog Knight, just find the good fight, one game at a time. And until that next time comes, Backlog Knight out. Now that was some really fucked up shit and I need to think about what I'm gonna do. What the fuck, Eve?